Hey, welcome back to Cool Kids Art, and let's draw the Underminer in Incredibles 2. So let's get started with a quick sketch, and then I will show you line by line on how you can draw this. Alright, so let's draw this, and this one is a pretty cool looking character. So we're going to start out with his nose. So we're just going to draw one curve. It's going to be pretty wide. And then we're going to draw the bottom of the nose, so it's going to be... Almost the same curve, but a little, probably a little bit lower. Okay, and then for his nostrils, we're just going to draw in two little curves like that. And then now let's draw in his mouth, which is going to be right below. We're just going to draw one curve like this. And then we're going to come down quite a bit, all the way past his nose. And then we're just going to close it off with one curve. So this is his lower lip and then since we're here let's all right, let's finish up uh, his mouth here so in here in the center let's draw a little line and then we'll just draw two little boxes rectangle so that's gonna be his teeth and then we're gonna curve on the side here just go up for his other teeth and then we'll just draw in two little lines like that okay so that's upper teeth and lower teeth is gonna be almost the same thing just draw like a box, divide it, and then it's just gonna have one tooth on each side. All right, and then let's see for his tongue in here. So in the middle, it's just gonna curve out, curve out. Okay, and I can actually let me let me shade this in real quick. The inside of the mouth. So you can see the uh, the teeth and the tongue a little bit better. All right, so from here we're gonna draw in his hat. So on his nose here, we're just gonna curve over it, and then we're gonna come out. And you don't have to go all the way out yet. Okay, so just go out a little bit. And then we're gonna finish off his face. So right around here, we can draw two brackets. Just kind of come down right around his uh, mouth area here. And then once we're down here, then we just kind of curve it all the way around the mouth, lower lip, and just kind of close it off. All right, so that's his face. So now let's finish up his hat. So up here, we're gonna draw another curve, which is gonna be the same. And then we're gonna go out kind of end it right around there and then from here we're going to finish off his hat so we're just going to go out so it's pretty wide it goes out pretty wide that's why now we, now we just kind of finish off that line okay and then from here we can draw his ear it's going to be under here so this one's easy and then for his hat it's got a little uh, light here so we just got to draw one big circle and mine's just a little bit wobbly. Very difficult to draw circles freehand. And then on the inside, just draw another circle. Okay, so now, and then from here, we're just gonna curve it out, finish up the hat. So we just go out, just curve it down. All right, so that's the face. Uh, so let's move down. So for his uh, little cape area here, so, well, it's like overalls. I'm gonna draw two circle. So around right the corner of the mouth, just come down, draw two circles. And then now we're gonna curve it, kind of around it, come around it and just go back up. So curve around it, go back up, slant it up all the way to the side. All right, and then we're gonna finish off this here. One curve around. And then now we're gonna draw in his tummy. So we're gonna come all the way around. So we can draw two brackets like this. And leave a little space here. We're gonna continue this curve, but we're only gonna draw in this curve. So we're leaving a little bit of space. And then once we're finished here, I guess we can draw in the legs. So we're just gonna come down. So this one's easy. Slant down, close it off. Curve, curve. Close it off. So that's his foot. 
and then here same thing slant close it off slant slant close it off okay so that's his legs and body so let, now let's finish up his arm so his arm it's gonna start up here slant close that off and then now for his lower arm I'm gonna come out slightly close that off so there's a couple of sections here so we're gonna come straight so this is just gonna be one rectangle and then now we'll come back in close that off so this is the same just opposite and now for his claw so this one's easy just gonna turn go back all go back up to the point here this one's gonna come slightly longer yeah, so that's one finger and that, that's his thumb. And then we'll just draw two little circles in here. And then there's going to be a little bit of detail here, but let's finish up his other arm first. Okay, so other arm's going to be the same. Close it off. We're going to flare out slightly. Close that off. And then again, it's going to be a rectangle. And now we're going to come in. Okay, and this one is gonna be dry, uh, holding his uh, microphone here. So this is gonna be his thumb right here. So we're just gonna come straight down. Okay, and then he's gonna have two other fingers here. So it's bent in. So just draw one and two. And then here's the palm, which we'll is close it off. So it's a little bit tricky. Okay, and then for the microphone itself, just come out. Let's draw a little rectangle. I draw one big circle here for the mic. Inside, another circle. And let's add in some lines here for the microphone. Just adding a grid. And then on the side here, we're just gonna come out and just add in, just kind of zigzag all the way around. All right, and then let's see for the detail here. Just gonna draw a couple of these lines here. So it's almost straight down. And then lastly, it's got a little cape. So it's gonna be behind here. We can start here and just go into the leg. So we come down into the leg. And that is it for this Underminer from The Incredibles 2. Hope you guys like the way it turned out. And if you do, please do give me a thumbs up and I will see you next time.